This is another uh, 12 liter uh, trail running vest made by a brand I'm uh, well familiar with, Dinafit. It is the Enduro 12. Uh, probably one of the most common questions is what's the best you know, trail running vest in the 12 liter range? So coincidentally, we just happen to have a few of them lying around that we've you know, found on sale or wanted to try out or looked really cool and, and we've used and we can tell you a little bit about them. So this is definitely a different vest than say the uh, Solomon Advanced Skin 12. The material on the Dinafit Enduro 12 is much more, uh, I guess, structured, less stretchy. It's kind of a ripstop nylon. This has, again, just a little more structured features to it. Uh, for example, the water bottle carries are really designed for hard water bottles. It's not the just elastic, you know, soft flask type water bottle carries. So if you're a hard uh, water bottle type person, this could be an excellent vest for you. But you can fit some pretty big bottles in here, whether the short ones or the tall ones they'll fit down in these front pockets. This vest has two main pockets on each side that carry a ton of snacks. Twix apparently is Danny's uh, favorite candy bar, or he maybe he just eats it uh, in embarrassment here alone in his gear room. You can access these you know, while you're wearing the vest, uh, two pockets on the side. The main compartment of the Backpack has the Unifit's little uh, waterproof pouch, which is convenient for some. It does have a loop. You can hang a bladder if you're a bladder type person. Uh, it's got some good storage space. They call this, you know, 12 liter. I'm sure they're just adding up all the volume of all the pockets and everything. I can tell you right now, this will not carry quite as much gear as the Solomon, only because the Solomon, you can just overstuff and overstuff and it just keeps stretching and stretching out. But again, if you want something with just a little more structure to it, this is you know, a better pack in that way. It does have an outside pocket for maybe those quick grab items. The way Dinafit handles the pull carry is you start with a V carry on your back. Most outings we go on start with maybe a long approach run or you know, basically you don't need your pulls yet. So these will attach to the back of the pack in a V, one here and one here, and they carry extremely well. You don't even notice they're there. And then when the going gets tough or you know, it's, it's pull time, you pull them out and start using them. After that, there's another pull carry feature that's designed to be used on the fly or times when you're using poles, then you wanna put them away. Then you wanna pull them out, then you wanna put them away. If you're doing that multiple times over and over, it has this little expandable pocket on the side. And so, you know, pulls fold up, and you just shove in, there is a little elastic. Obviously you put both of them in there. And then when you wanna use them again, it's just a holster, they come out. So it's a very easy way just to go, you know, back and forth without having to attach to your back or, you know, do uh, gymnastics or anything. Uh, one of our favorite features of any vest is a stretchy or elastic cinch in the front. So just, you know, breathing hard, chest can expand. It doesn't feel constrictive. It doesn't feel like you're locked on. Even though this, this bag is not as stretchy as some of the others, just having that elastic up in front helps a lot. Due to the material of the bag, it will definitely feel warmer on your back. That's one thing we've noticed every time we've used this is that you will sweat more. It just doesn't breathe as well, obviously because of the construction. So for Danny and I, it's kind of become a, you know, maybe winter trail running, spring trail running, when you don't mind having a little bit extra warmth and it almost acts as an insulating layer in some way. Another brief mention on the back, you've got two more of these water bottle style pockets. I've never used them for water bottles. Danny had dreams of carrying um, ice cold Mountain Dews in these pockets, but he never quite figured out how to keep them cold uh, farther than 15 minutes from the trailhead. So they've become just uh, shove it pockets for, again, gloves, hats, just things you're trying to get rid of, trash, whatever, on the fly. So overall, this, uh, like I said, has fit into the quiver um, 
you know, I'm, I'm not getting rid of mine. I have one identical to this. This is Danny's. Uh, because it is a nice kind of colder weather uh, trail running pack. Or if when you just feel like you need a little bit more uh, robustness, maybe in the materials, you know you're gonna be you know, rubbing up against rocks, uh, if you're worried about abrasion or anything, or you just like having something with a little more structure, not quite as um, you know, stretchy and you know, shirt-like like the Solomon bag. So that's the Dinafit. Enduro 12 trail running vest.